Yuck at the net. Yuck at the net, Colton. All right. Go ahead. Hold on. Let me just help you drag this. Go ahead. Keep going. Keep going. Go up just a little bit more. Hold on. Hold on. All right. Go ahead. Nope. No, I'll just let her run. I'll try to keep her straight. Yep, keep her straight. You're gonna net her, Colton. You got it, Colton. Oh, that's a bite to him. Yeah? I think that'd be a nice pull. What do you think, Colton? We saw that mark at about 70 feet. And yep, and the pull went out. Maybe you can turn this big clicker around. Work them muscles, G-Man. Ready, Colton. Coming towards us. Coming Keep reeling, keep reeling. Fast, fast, fast. Yeah, there she's head shaking still. Yep. This is just on a spoon. A pretty decent sized spoon, too. Nice. Some inline weights. Is he underwater? Just over 200 feet of water. That's just straight lead core. Here he comes, here he comes. Where is he? He's coming. Keep reeling, keep reeling. I think it might be a little laker. Keep reeling, keep reeling, Garen. Keep reeling. Yep, just pound it out, man. We're almost there. Yeah, lake trout. Your first lake trout. Yeah. Got Woo! Look at that, G! Oh! That's not a little one. That's a nice lake That's trout. That's a nice lake trout. Garden, way to go, buddy. Woo! Oh, look at trout. that, man. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You never know. <laughs> I'm a spoon, huh? Yeah, I totally spooned your eye. Look, Garden. See down his mouth? See that fish oh, down gosh. there? Oh, yeah. That's an owl wipe. It's like a giant minnow, basically. Wow. So, kind of like a shad? Kind yeah. of, yeah. But they only grow in usually on cold water lakes. Look at that, G. You want to hold it? You want to hold them? Sure. Right. I'll take the rod. I'll switch it. Let's go ahead. And... We didn't fully swallow the elbow either. Stand back a Got little him? bit because my phone doesn't. All right. It's a pretty, pretty big one. Very cool looking fish. Here, stand back on the a little yeah, bit from the front of the boat, maybe. Nice. What do you got to say about it, man? All right, guys, so you just saw the lake trout that we got on Lake Michigan that G-Man got. And um, today, um, since that was the only fish we had in the whole episode, uh, Colton did get a steelhead but right after that, but apparently we didn't record it. So instead, I figured we'd do a little catch and cook. So getting into the freezer, get some of that lake trout. We did get some salmon, too, um, from the other boat. And then another guy gave us some just to help round us out. But uh, got our lake trout fillets here. Got a couple of them. Gonna put them on the smoker, see how they taste. Stay tuned. So first off, we are going to let these fillets start thawing out in some cold water. Don't want them to get all mushy in warm water, so thawing them out in cold water. So it'll take a little while to get them thawed out. Okay, I got my brine made up. Got the fillets nice and thawed out. We're gonna pat them down so they can soak up all that brine. Put them in the fridge for about an hour and then uh, get them on the smoker. And I'll put a link to the brine recipe and the smoker recipe uh, in the about section for this video. Let them soak up. If you guys have any um, recipes you'd like to share, put them in the comments section. It'd be great to try it out. We got extra fillets of lake trout and, and salmon, so be interested in trying new things. Thanks. All right, we got our apple pellets in there. Now we're going up to 225. And now we wait a little while. All right, the smoker's ready. We uh, just pulled them out of the um, refrigerator. 
they've been in the refrigerator for about an hour, a little over. Pull them out, pat them dry, get them on a plate, and get them ready for the smoker. Alright, we got them on the smoker. It's at about an hour and a half to two hours. Uh, we'll check in here in a little bit. If it tastes anything like it smells, I think it's going to be a success. Take a little sneak peek of the progress. Alright, it's been two hours. Looking pretty good. It's time to pull them. some of the pin bones in there get a piece that we don't have any bones let's see how's it tasting not bad for lake trout definitely suggest it check out the link and uh, we'll also have g-man try it just see what he thinks so stay tuned all right g-man's home he's gonna try the lake trout If he can get it on his fork. Mm. Tastes like chicken. Good stuff, huh? Yeah. Hope you enjoy the episode. Stay tuned for another one.